hi everyone and welcome back to another meals of the week video we are starting the week with some spaghetti and meatballs so i've got these muscle food meatballs that i've defrosted i think i might actually halve these and make like mini meatballs because i think the boys will prefer them if they're a bit smaller and kind of mixed in with the sauce and the spaghetti so i think i'm going to halve them and then roll them into smaller meatballs and then i'm going to chuck in i've got a bit of green pepper left some mushrooms and i've done some grated carrot just to kind of offset the acidity of the tomatoes um, and then the sauce i'm going to use chopped tomatoes a beef stock cube some tomato puree mixed herbs and then this is actually chicken seasoning but if you look at the ingredients it's just like paprika yeast onion garlic salt pepper all of that kind of stuff so that can go with anything really so i'm going to chuck a bit of that in and then i've got some whole wheat spaghetti that is open and um, needs to be used up before we move so we're going to have some spaghetti and then i've also got a garlic baguette out of the freezer which i will pop in the oven as well and you know us we will probably have some grated cheese on the top as well so yeah quite a quick and easy one we have we don't have meatballs very often i don't think um the boys are as keen on them as like bolognese but i got them in the muscle food um hamper so um yeah we're going to use those up so I will come back and show you when it's all ready. And here is our spaghetti and meatballs already. So as you can see in the footage that I showed you, I pan fried the meatballs and then just removed them while I did the sauce and added it back in so they could finish cooking in the sauce and just left that so it thickened up because I can't bear when you have like tomato sauces and they're all watery and leaky. I like it nice and thick. Um, so that one's mine. And then I have saved a portion as well because obviously my husband, as I mentioned, if you saw my grocery shop, is away um, for a few days with work. So I've got an extra portion. And then these are the boys, they've got the same. And then I've also done our usual grated cheese and we've got some garlic bread to go on the side as well. So it smells really tasty. And I think these meatballs are quite well seasoned if I remember from when we've had them before. So yeah, that's what we're starting the week with. Hi everyone, tonight for dinner the freezer tapas begins um, for our kind of using up what we've got. So I'm going to do some homemade chips in the air fryer. I'm going to do some sweet corn um, for like a bit of veg. And then I'm going to do the rest of these chicken nuggets. And I'm also going to do some of the sausage rolls. And we're going to kind of just have a little bit of a picky kind of tea and have some sausage rolls, some chicken, some chips and some corn. Um just to use up kind of some bits and bobs and stuff really um asked the boys what they wanted and they said that they were happy to just kind of have a few bits and bobs so it's going to just go in the air fryer and then i'll do some corn i might have a bit of like salad or something on the side of mine as well and here's our dinner ready so like i say slightly beige i've added some salad to mine um there are some more sausage rolls if anyone wants any more and i've just done some chicken and some chips and the boys have got the same, except they don't have tomato on their plates. So, um, so yeah, that is what we are having for our kind of freezer using up dinner this evening. Hi everyone, tonight for dinner we are having a chicken noodle dish. So I'm going to do kind of two different versions. So the boys are going to have chicken with some of the chicken seasoning on and i'll do them some raw pepper and carrot and maybe cucumber as well and they're going to have some of these um chicken flavored noodles because they like these like flavored like instant noodles um and then i'm going to do myself kind of a stir fry so i've got some of the fine um singapore kind of noodles so I'm going to cook those. I've got some chicken here with some soy honey and chilli and garlic in. So I'm going to marinate that and um, do that. And then I'm also going to have some veg with mine as well. So I've got mushroom, carrot and red pepper. So I'm going to do mine like a stir fry. And there's I'm going to do more like chicken noodles and some raw veg. So kind of the same and a good way just to use up some bits and bobs. Um, they really, really like this chicken seasoning. So if like you've got kids and they like 
flavour but not hot if you know what I mean um this one's a really good one to try and I think it was a couple of quid but you do get a lot in there um so yeah I'd recommend that one so yeah I'm just gonna um I think I might do my chicken in the air fryer and then kind of just um mix it like with my noodles so I'll come back and show you when it's all ready And here's our dinner ready. So I did my chicken and veg in the air fryer and just topped it, um, put it on top of the noodles, just with the soy and honey. And then the boys have got their chicken and noodles and veg separately. So it smells really, really tasty. Um, and they do love these noodles. Um, I think I might have overdone my noodles slightly, but it still smells really, really tasty. And it's just soy, honey, chilli and garlic on my chicken. Hi everyone, tonight for dinner we are having some chicken fajitas. So I've got two chicken breasts, these are the muscle food ones, and they're really big, so um, I'm just gonna dice those up and that will be enough for the four of us. And then if you bulk out with veg, so I've got two red peppers, a red onion and some mushrooms, and we're just gonna have it in some of these um, Neville's, these are the cheaper, like Tesco wraps, I think they're 99p, um, and you get eight in there, so that's more than enough um, for us. And I normally just do some grated cheese. So if you've been watching a while, you'll know that I cook it and then I will um, do, take the boys out and then add some like chilli to ours to kind of make it a bit spicier. Um, but I've just got some chicken seasoning, some garlic and some black pepper on these ones and a little bit of oil. Um, so they've got a nice flavour. Um, so yeah, I'll just dice those up. I'm just going to fry that all up and I'll show you it when it's ready. And here's dinner ready. So I've just fried everything up together. This one is ours. I've added some chilli flakes and then that one's the boys. And we've just got it with some tortilla wraps and some grated cheese. Hi everyone. Saturday's dinner for the boys is a thin and crispy pepperoni pizza. And then I've just done some of the McCain naked chips in the oven as well. I did them in the oven because I was putting the oven on for the pizza. So say putting the air fryer on as well. And then I've done some cucumber on the side. So they've both got the same. Um, so that's what they're having. And we're having steak a bit later. So I'll come back and show you ours when it's ready. And here's our dinner plated up. So we've got fillet steak, which I just seasoned with salt and pepper and pan fried. Did it for about four minutes each side to get it like medium rare. And then I've done a fried egg. And then we've just got some of the McCain naked chips, which did in the air fryer and some beans. And then I've got the same, except for I've also done myself some cooked tomatoes in the air fryer as well. But Yanis doesn't like cooked tomato. So that's what we're having. Looks super tasty and we're gonna enjoy this and then we're gonna have some puts. today is sunday and we are having our usual roast so i've done roast beef i slightly overdid the beef but it is still marginally pink and um, we've got yorkshire puddings roast potatoes carrots and cauliflower cheese this week so um we've both got the same the boys don't like cauliflower cheese so they've just got carrots and archie's got yorkshires henry doesn't like yorkshires so um he's just got the carrots and potatoes and then i do have a bit of beef left um as well if anyone wants any more so that's what we're having today. Hi everyone, today for dinner we are having one of these Sainsbury's Taste the Difference beef lasagnas. Um, I just got one of the 800 gram ones because it's just me and the boys. So I thought it says serves two, but obviously it's me and two smaller people. So I thought that would be plenty. And I've also done it with some chips in the air fryer and some corn. So it's a, a really decent sized portion if you add a bit of sides. Um, so yeah, that one's Henry's Archie's and that one's mine. So a real quick and easy. Um, I have been known to make my own lasagnas, but these ones are so tasty and it's so nice to just shove it in the oven and it comes out perfectly. So I thought I would cheat this week. So yeah, that's what we are having for dinner this evening. 
Thanks so much for watching. If you've enjoyed, please don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you next time.